Thank you everyone for being here. Um, I love seeing that it's a Sunday. It's a day that unless you are passionate about what you want to do, you wouldn't be here. And so just off the hand, I want to tell you girls how impressed I am and how I commend you for really being here. That means you really, really want this. Okay, so for me, you get a big applause for that. That means that you are survivors in my book. <laughs> so welcome, everyone. I am uh, greeting everybody, of course. Good afternoon. Welcome to the 2011 San Antonio Roses Audition. The auditions are being brought to you by Roses Entertainment and Bali Total Fitness, of course, which is where we are today. Bali Total Fitness is the new corporate sponsor for the San Antonio Roses, and they're providing this aerobic room for their practices and the facility to stay in shape for the whole season, everybody. Okay? For the whole season. And I'm going to see if somehow I'll kind of have to, like, find my way. I was on Survivor, so I think I can sneak my way into getting myself voted into the Bali Island. Would mind that to stay in shape for the season. So special thanks to, I'm not sure if he's here, if he can raise his hand, to the Bali Total Fitness Manager, Mr. Cesar Rangel, if he's around. So we'll thank him uh, if he's not here. Anyhow, so let's, let's, let me tell you a little bit, for those who haven't been here, what's been going on. In fact, myself, I wasn't aware of this, but what's been going on is the contestants have been here working very hard all morning. No, am I right? Yeah. Yes. Learning a routine. So I'm going to actually, you know this, so I'm going to turn around over here and have the judges know what's been going on. They have been learning a routine all morning, practicing very hard for this audition. The routine was taught to them by the new Roses choreographer, and if you could stand up, it's Melissa Martinez. <laughs> a little bit about Melissa. Melissa is a former six-year member of the Spurs Silver Dancer and was the UCSA Spirit Program Head Coach and Coordinator for the past 10 years. Uh, she has been cheering and dancing since the age of eight, which was maybe about 10, 10 years or so. Um, and she's saying, no, wait a minute, I was it's been 12 years. Uh, in, in these areas, not just one type of dancing, but she's an expert in jazz, tap, hip hop, tumbling, cheerleading, and professional dance. So, Ms. Melissa, I have to tell you, you would be really proud of me. Guess what I just did and won. I was asked to do for another charity organization a Dancing with the Stars type event, and I had to practice all week to learn my choreography, just like what you guys see on Dancing with the Stars. That was me in the studio. I worked my butt off two, three hours a day all week, and I won. I won the school. I won the Thank you. Thank you. I'm so proud because it was very hard. But I did it. I waltzed my way into winning that. I'm so happy. And it was for an organization called San Antonio Dream Center. So it was nice to be able, fun way to give back. So anyhow, she has much dance uh, expertise. Uh, 20 years. I had to give it away, Miss Melissa. I had to give it away because it doesn't look like it at all. So you're welcome. So she has over 20 years experience uh, in the dance and cheerleading industry, including performing, competition, instructing, judging, and directing. So if you wouldn't mind me standing up again, Melissa, so we can give you another round of applause. And I can tell these ladies are very pleased with your work. I can't wait to see it. So um, I'm going to do a little bit of an explanation. It's a little lengthy, but it's very important also so you can know the caliber.